and the right to go to Williamsport, Pennsylvania in the Little League World Series. Lucas goes down. Paoletta steals second. Uh, just heads up baseball by Paoletta. Lucas goes down on strikes. Hockenberry just loses track of him for one second. Okay, they're asking if there was interference on the part of the batter walking to the dugout. So the umpires are going to confer on this. Well, you see Lucas strike out, and you see him just taking a couple steps toward the dugout. Does get in the way. Can Hockenberry oh, make a play? Was it interference? Lucas takes a couple steps. Well, there was contact, and you can see Hockenberry shrugging his shoulders as Lucas strides to the dugout. So must a catcher attempt to throw in order to draw that interference call? Coach. Let's see what the call is going to be here. He walked up in front of the catcher and was trying to make the throw. And the delayed speed. So he got out. He's out. He's out. So out by the uh, batter's interference on the catcher. That is the signal from home plate umpire Jerry Fisher. Sorry. Paoletta delaying and then going. Well, they're going to de check this out, make sure they get it right. Lucas. First base is out before he goes back to first base. So they're going to they're going to decide if he goes back to first base or if he's out. He's back to first base. So. This is where Little League rules may diverge from Major League rules. I'm not an authority on the Major League Baseball rule book, so I don't know. Well, a but break there. Back to first, yeah. This is not correct. Now, Hockenberry is saying this is not correct. In Major League Baseball, he would be out, but some Little League rules do differ from Major League rules. Interference, and the runner is out on an interference call. Get the rule book, please. Oh, they did call the They are going to look for the rule book yep. here. They are going to look for the Little League rule book, and they might as well get it right. I mean, the stakes are huge here. Single elimination, semifinals, we're in extra innings. Well, interference at the big league level, the base runner would be thrown out. Called out, I should say. Watch Will Lucas. He's going to go down on strikes. He's gonna, as soon as he strikes out, he takes a couple steps toward the dugout, gets in the way of Hockenberry, does make contact with him. So there definitely is interference. But they're going to check the Little League rule book, make sure they get it right. So the two managers are just discussing it. It's just a matter of making sure they've got the rule right because they have ruled that the batter interfered with catcher Ryan Hockenberry. So it's going to be in black and white. They're just going to look it up and make sure. And it looks at that at one point that Hale Letter was in no man's land. He came off the base and he had to make a decision. Decides to go to second base. This is where uh, those long bus rides helped you out, right? Because I'm sure you were had your nose buried in the rule book, memorizing them and quizzing each other. Yes, right? yeah, absolutely. That's it. That's what those six, eight-hour bus rides are for. There weren't any card games going no, on. There absolutely were suitcases not. full of um, soda pop. 
<laughs> or something. Right, but this is a very, very important part of this game. Yeah, well, it's, it's worth the delay to get it right. And alertly, Ryan Hockenberry is keeping Sammy Premsager throwing. Because what you don't want is for the pitcher to go cold and then throw a meatball. Oh, by the way, the next man due up for Fairfield, Connecticut, is the cleanupter, Matt Kubel, who is currently the pitcher. And he could end this thing with one swing, whether there's somebody on or not. Okay, thanks for checking. Okay, so they double checked. He goes back to first, I think I overheard. Here we go. Yep. And, and that is exactly the case. The Little League Baseball rules differ from Major League rules because part of the, the mission of Little League Baseball is instruction. Well, at the, at the Major League level, the runner would have been called out on the interference call. But as you mentioned, Little League is different. 